Yo, what is going on, everybody? This is RBT, and welcome back to another episode of the Miami Dolphins Madden 18 Connected Franchise Series. We are one game and one win away from making it to the Super Bowl, which would be my biggest accomplish yet as an owner for all of my Madden 18 franchise series. It's because this Miami Dolphins team easily, I believe, was the worst team we have taken over as owner and rebuilt them, and like, we're doing good. Like, well, I mean, it depends what you consider good, but I mean, 12 and 4 is better than as bad as they were as we took them over, but like, gosh dang, dude, I'm having, I'm recording all these episodes ahead of time before I go to LA, like EA Play at, in uh, LA, and I've recorded the previous two episodes right before this, and dog, I am playing awful, but at the same time, I'm playing at a level that is allowing me to win, but it's going to have to be elevated at this point because the Browns are a good team. And if you're unfamiliar with how this series has worked or how all my series has worked, the past three franchise series we've done, we've stayed within the same connected franchise. The reason the Browns are so good is because they're the last team we used. So basically, well, technically, like, for, like it's a fact that I'm playing against my former team who is reigning Super Bowl champions. They are good. They are a 95 overall team, which is unheard of in franchise. We're also a 95 overall team, so it's an even matchup. We're playing in Cleveland, but we have actually played them once before this season, and we barely won that game, but we did win. We, Like I said, we played them in Cleveland that game. We beat them 17-13, to 13, so we can do it because we've done it before. It was not the greatest of games. Like They outgained us. We just didn't play well. We, uh, Deshaun Watson had a spectacular 58.8 quarterback rating. We ran for a decent amount of yards, but I think we're going to have to play better and elevate our games from like how we've played the last two episodes if we're going to want to beat the Browns and make it to the Super Bowl, which everything leads up to this point. But do want to see at the beginning of, today, uh, beginning of today's episode how the last couple games went in the playoffs. So the Browns destroyed the Texans by 21. The Rams... And the Falcons are the two teams playing for the NFC crown as we are going to be taking on today the Cleveland Browns and their MVP, which is actually Josh Ro uh, Josh Rosen is the MVP in the uh, in the NFL. So this is this is going to be scary. Just hopefully don't lose. I just got to play better. Hopefully that's the case, because if we actually lose, I'm going to be extremely upset. So if you guys could like the video, that would be cool. And also, if you could subscribe, that would also be cool, because at 200,000 subscribers, we're doing a console giveaway. And if you want a second chance to win a console, all you have to do is follow me on Instagram. A whole separate giveaway once we hit 10,000 followers, so go follow me if you haven't already. Link in the description box below. And also, I shout out somebody every single video. All you have to do is be one of the first 10 people to comment on a video, and you have a chance to be shouted out in the next one. So yeah, I kept this short so you guys stop getting mad at me. Let's get back into the video. If I can make this throw, Deshaun Watson, please. The kick that I caught it. Okay, so you might be curious. RBT, why was it second down in like 26? Don't worry about it. It's not like, you know, I want to go throw the ball. I got sacked. I fumbled. My offensive lineman recovered, ran backwards. He fumbled. Then I finally recovered it. Not like that happened. That definitely didn't happen. It, this, this game's already started off wild. I don't like it. It's freaking snowing. It's freaking snowing. I have on white jerseys. I can't hardly like tell the difference between my white jerseys and the snow. So this game has already got off to a fantastic start. So let's just score some points or we can just get sacked because that guy just come out of nowhere. Came out of nowhere. So, all right, this is, this is, I'm already nervous. This is a good team. Okay, this is actually brings up a point. I need to show you guys who the Browns have because you guys, Unless you're like, maybe you're not familiar with the Browns that we used in the last series, or maybe like you are familiar, but they picked up some new players. The MVP, A overall, Josh Rosen. And though I have decent, not the greatest, but a pretty good one two punch at running back. I mean, a 99 Le'Veon Bell, 97 Alvin Kamara, that's pretty good. Wide receiver, decent core there with Adam Thielen, T.Y. Hilton, Juju Smith, and topped off by Zach Turk. Tight end, you know, a decent one two three punch, and Evan Ingram, David and Joe Kuwain, Jake Butt. Good offensive line, Trent. Forrest, they have Travis, they have David DeCastro, and a measly 87 Marcus Gilbert at right tackle. Now, pretty good defensive ends. This is where Joey Bosa went. The other defensive end, like, he's okay. Miles Garrett, he's decent. Defensive tackle, not bad. Gerald McCoy. Linebacker core, I mean, it could be better. I mean, they have 99 Von Miller, like, that's not that great. 99 Luke Keekley, once again, that's not that great. 
in an, an awful 92 overall Telvin Smith. Their cornerback core, I've seen much better. Like 94 Marshawn Lattimore, 93 A.J. Bouye, 90 overall Xavier Rhodes, and 88 overall Josh Norman. A lot better can be done. And an awful 88 overall Tyron Matthew and an 89 Jamal Adams. Like, this team, it's okay, but we should be destroying them, you know? Like, our team is far superior, you know? Far superior. Second down and 15. No worries here. No worries whatsoever. Bad people. Throw the ball away. Shoot. Third down and 15. Deshaun got destroyed. If he gets hurt and we win and we go to the Super Bowl, well, first of all, if he gets hurt, we're probably definitely not going to win against the Browns. But, um... If we win and somehow, if he hurts, gets hurt, and somehow we win, like, we're just not going to win the Super Bowl with freaking Nick Foles or whoever the other guy's name is. I've lost the faith in him. Uh oh, oh. Bad people again. Yeah. Good. You know what? I just want to do it. I just want to freaking do it. Well, you're going to give up a touchdown if you don't pick this up, but I just want to do it. I'm just feeling it. It's in my. It just came to my head, and I want to do it. Fake, fake punt. I'm going to do it. He's wide open. Please make the throw. Please. Oh, my. We actually did it. It actually happened. We actually completed a fake punt. Oh, my gosh. I'm a happy boy. I'm a happy boy in a happy world. How did we do 97% of the time in good conditions? That gets overthrown. And it's just snowing, but Marquette King said, I'm the man and did it. So we're run the ball here and get a whole, like, four yards, three yards maybe. But, uh... I mean, this has been a, an unorthodox start, to say the least. So, convert on like a second down, third down to 26, right? Maybe? I don't remember. My brain isn't working. And uh, we pick up a fake punt. Interesting. Second down to seven. Um, bad guy. Where is the coverage? Where is the pass protection? This isn't the greatest of starts. Like, this, is, this isn't making me a happy guy. So, uh, second down of 14, we need a miracle. Like, it's probably, we're, we're not going to make a field goal from this range when it's snowing. It's probably like a 103 mile per hour wind. Let's see what happens here. Um, let's just not get sacked again. We're scrambling. Deshaun, go. Deshaun, we have a block. Slide. Oh, shoot. I don't know if we got it. First and 10. Deshaun, the man. If we actually, dude, if we score a touchdown on this drive after the nonsense that has happened, I'm going to be extremely happy with the way this thing has started. So first down and 10. It's, it's actually pretty difficult to determine what our receivers are and what the snow is. Like, I never thought I would have to, like, try to not throw it to the snow because I think the, the snow is my receivers, you know? You get what I'm saying? It's pretty freaking difficult. Have we ha We've had the ball the whole first quarter, haven't we? That's good. It just, I mean, they can't score if they don't have the ball, right? Run here. Saquon Barkley. Like, see, that run worked so well in that division, in that wild card round, but we've gotten negative yardage with it so far. So, this has been a weird game. I'm just going to close my eyes and take, like, a five-second nap. I've recorded, like, seven straight videos, and I'm, I'm kind of over-exaggerating. It's, like, actually, like, four, but I'm still extremely tired. I'm just going to take a nap, and it's going to be the second quarter when I open my eyes. And that just rejuvenated me, that great nap to score a touchdown. I'm not going to kick a field goal. I'm going to score a touchdown. That's what I'm going to do. The nap, the power of the nap, the power of the nap, the power of the nap. Please, please catch this. Unbelievable. Oh, I just knew it was going to happen. I just knew he was going to drop it. 90 overall freaking Antonio Brown. Unbelievable. Scenes drops a touchdown pass. Third down and goal. It is unbelievable. Unbelievable. Here we go. Here it is. Deshaun Scramp. Oh, he's up. Oh, my. We need something good. Somebody, please. Big things. Dudes, that is not what I wanted to happen. I'm upset, dude. I am so... All because a freaking 90 overall receiver drops a touchdown pass. Dude, I was feeling the moment. I was just feeling the moment, man. He broke a tackle. That would have been a sick play. I was feeling the moment. And now we don't even get any points. All that for freaking nothing. All of that, we just went through to get zero points. And I'm sitting here falling, 
Thank God. I don't know what kind of tackle that was, but I'm happy it happened. Because that could have been very bad. That was one of the strangest tackles in NFL history. But I'm glad it happened on my side of the ball. So second down and nine. Can we? I jumped the gap pretty good. So I want to... Who do we hurt? Le'Veon Bell's hurt. Check one. Uh, I'm trying to get a safety here. I really want a safety. I really want it. You know, I would love it. I would love it. Now we just need to injure Alvin Kamara. I don't think we have, they have any good backwards behind him. So let's do this. Can we get a safety? Oh my! Oh, dude, we've had some crazy looking tackles. But unfortunately, they run the ball three straight plays. Guess, I mean, obviously you don't want to throw a pick, but like, I mean, could have been worse. You know, they could have thought we could have got a pick six. You know, I don't know what I'm saying. I really don't know what I'm saying. I just want to score and win this game. I just want to win it. Man, I just a block call. That would a punt. Dude, this isn't good. Jarvis make the man miss. Didn't make the man miss. Oh, my. How are we at this point? How do we not have points? How do we? How, why did that even happen? Why did that happen? First down and ten. I'm starting to lose my voice already, which is not good when I have like ten more videos to make. But uh, that's a good play. Midfield. I don't know why I ran. Hurry up. Maybe it's just nature telling me I needed to do it, and maybe we're gonna score a touchdown here. I don't know. Let's think positive, right? Running backwards. There's bad people coming. Hey, can you run the field? Why? Can you just? The oh, what was that? What was that? Dude, what did we just witness? What did we just witness? That was a crazy shovel pass. Dude, that was the strongest looking shovel pass I've ever seen in my existence. Third and three. Can we just Saquon go? Saquon go do the stuff. Like, can we just please score a touchdown on this drive? I, I mean, dude, I would take a five point touchdown. Honest to God. I would rather take a five point touchdown than nothing. Can we do it? Four minutes. Like, we, they've, had, they've had like three yards of offense this whole game, which has been a, this has been a weird game at this point. But let's just get some points here. Saquon. Go. Saquon go, Saquon go. Dude, that's a lot of snow. That's a lot of freaking snow. So, I don't know what to do. It's, it's actually hurting my, like, I'm getting a headache. Like, I'm not even a lot. Looking at this white screen is giving me a headache. And trying to determine the difference between snow and, and human beings is really hurting my brain. So Saquon gets a couple good yards. Dude, that, like that, this image right here, that hurts my eyeballs. So, I'm just going to continue to run the ball, continue to run it, because I just, I don't know. I really don't know. I don't have the brain capacity right now to throw the football, like, and make good decisions. So we're just going to run it with Christian. Christian's going to run it. He's going to get it. Good spin move. Christian, go. Christian, that dog, his neck got snapped. I got to go back and look at that. That was a bad-looking face mask. So we're going to get half the distance to the goal from the spot of the foul. So we get the ball to a five-yard line. Jesse Williams, bro, you need to make better decision make. Uh, do You need to partake in better decision making because this had to hurt. Look at this. Let's zoom in a little bit. Let's get a little bit of the thumbnail action. Dog, that had to hurt. Dudes, why? 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 We just lost six yards. So now it's a second and goal from that gosh dang 11. Oh my. Let's run. Okay, so we didn't, you know, score a touchdown to slants earlier. But I'm going to give it another chance. We had an open receiver, Antonio. He caught it, but he dropped it, you know? Give him another chance here. So wait a second, wait a second. We're getting pressured. Dude, this always happens. It always happens just like this. Good things happen, but then bad things happen. You know? I mean, <laughs> I don't know, man. Third and goal from the 17. This has been a weird game. I just, I'll take a field goal. I'll honestly, God, just kick a field goal if we have to. But can we block? I know that's a tough question to ask you. But can we just please do our job? We've already been sacked five times. 
five. 44 yard field goal. Eight mile per hour wind in my face. I did not get good power at all. I don't know how that went in. I have no idea how that actually just went in, but it did, and I'm not going to question physics at this point. Dudes, I am so confused. Why is Marquette King on the field? Why is Marquette... <laughs> Somebody's got some explaining to do. Somebody has got some explaining to do. I'm extremely confused how the ball goes from here to all the way over here. I've never seen such a thing. That's a crazy looking trick play. Because the whole entire time Jake Butts trying to act like he has the ball, but at the end of the day, T.Y. had it. I really don't know how the laws of physics can define this this snap, you know, from actually happening, but it happened. It freaking happened, that's for sure. He's trying to hide the ball, you see it? He's trying to hide it. But at least my defense was aware enough. He almost picked it up, but... I, I'm still sort of confused, sort of confused, but at the end of the day, I, I don't know. I really don't know at the end of the day, because that was a strange set of events. B, we need this catch. We need this catch bad. Amari Cooper with the catch. Okay, so this is going to take a oh, 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 This is going to be hard. It's going to be a long field goal. It's going to be a long freaking field goal. A 55-yard field goal. And the wind is still at our. Oh, this isn't gonna go. This is not gonna go in. This is just a fact. It's just a freaking fact. Perfect power, almost perfect accuracy. Dog, he's gonna bring it back. He's. I just know it. I just freaking know it. So this was old. We've had some. Okay, so we've had some stuff happen. We've had some unorthodox stuff happen. That's for sure. But we have the lead. And I guess is all that matters. Dog, I literally max protected. I am max protected there. That's our. St I just I'm just curious. I just want to. I'm max protected. We have two guys blocking, and he he literally there's four guys that can block him, and that's like a 76 overall defensive tackle sacking me. I mean, I'm not saying anything bad about it. Just, I guess at the end of the day, just a missed assignment. That's all it is, I suppose. That's all it is. So, here we go. I'm not gonna. I'm just not gonna pick this up. It's just not gonna happen. They're down to 19. This is. Gonna, I guess it's gonna end 3-2 or something. Or like four. They're gonna get four points. They're gonna beat me 4-3. It's just bound to happen. Just absolutely bound to happen. Fast guy. He's. I have no words that this is my eighth sack. My eighth time being sacked. This is a joy. A joy and an honor to take part in. Here we go, big play. They actually moved the ball a little bit. So is it third down and two? <laughs> I mean, if they score a touchdown, pretty much we're outscored. Thank the Lord for that idiot. That freaking nincompoop. 99 overall, David DeCastro. I guess he has 99 awareness, but he just went off. Oh, well, not didn't go off sides. It's kind of impossible to do so as an offensive lineman, but he did have a false start. Was it called? What, what is it? I don't know. I don't know what I'm on about. Third down and eight. Can we just, like, if we get a stop here? I'm just, I'm honest to God, I just want to chew the clock. I just want to get this over with. Josh is squirming. He is squirming. He ran out of bounds. I think he ran out of bounds short. What an idiot. Did he do it? Fourth and one. I think they're going to go for it. I guarantee it. No, they aren't. Third down and two. I'm literally just running the ball to the middle because I'm going to throw a pick six or something. We got it. Dude, I'm chewing the clock. I don't care. I'm going to chew the clock. If we win three, nothing, dog. That's better than losing four, three. Like, dude, I'm not freaking lying. If I get this first down, I'm going to keep running the ball every gosh dang play. Let's walk aside from this one because of third and four. A's open. Please catch this. Please. I caught it. Me. I did it. That's me. I did it. Dude, if we actually win this game through nothing, I'm going to laugh. But at the same time, I'm going I'm to be pretty freaking happy because this has been mental. Y'all, the fact that all this stuff has happened in a three to nothing game. The, this game decides the freaking Super Bowl. Fourth quarter Super Bowl on the line. 
Oh my. So here it is, dudes. I guarantee. If we don't get this, they're gonna win. It's just gonna happen. Third and nine. Please, somebody do something good. I'm gonna throw this to this guy. Amari Cooper, he caught it. He actually caught it. That is surprising and it makes me so happy at the same time. We might actually win this game. We might actually win this game 3 0. I don't think that's ever happened in my existence. Saquon Barkley's trying to make it 10 0, though. In the flesh territory, we might be actually, we might actually be able to double our score. So third down and eight, I'm keeping the ball on the freaking ground here. Uh oh, that didn't go anywhere. So uh, this is a, uh, I don't know what to do. I really have no idea what to do. Fourth down and nine. Super Bowl berth on the. I'm not kicking off 51 yard field goal number one. I was it really matter. Number two. Dude, I'm just gonna stick with what I know. I'm gonna stick with what I know. I'm gonna run. I'm just gonna run slants. I'm gonna run slants. This could be a. This is probably a massive mistake. Fourth down and nine. Super Bowl berth on the freaking line. Oh, I'm scared. This is a mistake. This is a mistake. This is a big mistake. I'm doing it. I'm doing it. I'm doing it. Wait a second. Wait a second. X, please, dude. I'm begging you, Antonio Brown. <laughs> dude, we're going to the freaking Super Bowl as we're gonna beat the Browns. What a what a way to end it! Freaking Antonio Brown catches a pass so we can beat the Browns. We're gonna beat the Cleveland Browns three to nothing. Three. We actually just won a game of Madden against the computer three to nothing. So this just fits the theme of this season. It's not always been good. Is not always been fun. Is not always been the most like exciting score. Sometimes it might be three to nothing, but we've scratched and clawed our way in interesting situations. Even when we have teleporting footballs and and we have punters playing defensive end, we find ways to win games. As the Miami Dolphins are a FC champions go from the, the very minimum, no matter if we lose the Super Bowl, 115 to square. <laughs> the Miami Dolphins have gone from the worst team in the NFL to conference champions in a strange way. It was a weird game. They, their MV, the MVP of the NFL was three of five. Dog, our punter almost had more passing guards than their MVP quarterback. But it was a dude. How many yards did they actually have? They had 46 yards of offense. We held the ball for a total of 22 minutes to their five. Strange game. Strange game, I must say. So we did it. It was strange, but we did it. So now it is time to see. Who are actually going to be playing in the Super Bowl, and it's gonna be the Los Angeles Rams. So for the second time, I'm gonna be taking on a team from Los Angeles, and I don't know where we're playing at. I don't know where it is. We're taking it's the was in Miami. We're playing a home. Oh, uh, how did the okay? I'm how did the whole freaking eight and eight Rams? Make it to the Super Bowl. I am. I don't understand. That's weird. That's really weird. Who did they beat? They beat the Falcons by a lot. They beat the Vikings by a lot, and they barely beat the Eagles. But they're a team on a roll, and it's the Super Bowl. And I'm scared, but we're here. So <laughs> that was weird. But for whatever reason, hopefully, guys did enjoy. And if you did, make sure to drop a like. And the quicker or the fat or the more likes we get on this episode. The quicker the final episode of the Dolphin series will come out. Maybe tomorrow we'll have to see. But guys, be sure to subscribe if you are new. And turn on the notification bell if you haven't. But with that said, I'll catch you guys next time. Have a great rest of your day. God bless and peace.